Hi, welcome to SeniorSafetyAdvice.com. I'm Esther Kane. Today I'm going to talk to you about how to get in and out of a bathtub with a bad knee. Uh, we actually got this question a few weeks ago and I responded to them and I was going to do a video at that point but then just a few days later I actually injured my knee. It's an old injury that flares up every now and then but um, I thought well now is the perfect time. It definitely is the universe telling me it's time to make this video. All right, so there's a few things that you need to know. One, if you have two bad knees, there's really no safe way to get in and out of a bathtub without some assistance. So I would recommend either a bathtub lift, which is a mechanical thing that you put inside your tub and it can literally lift you up and lift you down, um, sort of like a bath bench or a tub bench that um, can lower you and raise you up which is amazing anyway um, that or if you can afford it and uh, you know have the place to do it have a walk-in tub especially if it's a chronic condition um, I would definitely recommend a walk-in tub or a bathtub lift um, anyway you do need a lot of upper body strength uh, whether it's two leg uh, two knees or one knee so if you don't have upper body strength to help lift yourself up out of the tub and lower yourself down, then I would recommend again that you use an adaptive piece of equipment like a tub lift or a walk-in tub. Um, or of course you can have somebody help you, but it's kind of cumbersome and difficult to help someone get in and out of the tub when you're not actually in the tub with them. So that can be uh, not so easy for sure. Um, you also need a bath mat, a non-slip bath mat right by your bathtub because so when you get out, you know, you're going to be dripping wet. So you don't want that water on the floor and possibly slip on, on it and, and cause even more injury. And you also, I recommend to have a bench. Now I'm sitting on a bench right now. Um, I put it right there by the bathtub and it's for the purpose so that you're not constant when you get out of the tub, especially you're not just sitting on the edge of the tub not very comfortable it's not very safe so i recommend a bench you can put a towel on it you know whatever but something sturdy steady a chair anything that will hold you and you know keep you comfortable while you dry after you get out all right so i'm going to show you the simple steps on how to get into the tub first thing you want to do is um, put your leg up i put my my bad leg up but of course it just depends on what side your faucets are on so that will play a part in which leg you go up it really doesn't matter which one goes up first but hopefully you're able to lift it so um, with your bad leg up you're going to scoot yourself from the bench or seat that you're on onto the edge of the tub and remember you need some upper body strength now with just one bad knee you can definitely use the other leg to help you um, okay if you have a grab bar you can reach for that or just reach for the edge of the tub but you do need to be able to do that so you can reach over the other hand is going to go on this side of the tub and your leg is going to go in and you know your good leg will come up and go right directly into the tub now you're going to be balancing yourself above you know where you're going to sit I put a towel down here actually but where you're going to sit but you're, for a while you're going to be holding yourself up with both arms so know that you can lower yourself down slowly holding your weight up with your arms and also with your good leg and then you can scoot yourself in you know appropriately as need be now when you're done and over you're going to basically reverse the process but you're gonna need a little more upper body strength than when you were getting down. Your leg can certainly help. You're gonna bring your good leg up and push with that leg and with your arms. You definitely need your arms and you're going to scoot your tuchus, uh, tush right on the edge of the bathtub. Bring your leg out, bring the bad leg up and you know, I don't know if you're gonna, if you have it uh, wrapped in some way, Probably, maybe not, depends. And then of course, get right onto the bench and um, proceed to dry. It's really not that complicated. Um, a grab bar won't necessarily help you too much getting up. 
because a grab bar you're normally going to pull but what you really need to do is to push so a grab bar may help you to hold on to something while you're scooting over but you eventually need to let go of that and hold on to the sides of the tub to get in. Um, like I said, if you don't have the upper body strength to do that, then I strongly recommend a bathtub lift or a walk-in tub. I'll have links to those um, products below and also we have some articles on them as well. And you can get some more information about how to get them or what they look like and where to buy them and all that great stuff. Well, I hope that this video was useful and um, that it helps you in some way. And if you do have a bum knee, I'm sorry. I know that can be limiting. <laughs> I know it can be uh, painful as well. So hope you're doing your physical therapy and that it gets better. All right. Don't forget to subscribe and click the like button. And of course, give us any comments, recommendations, suggestions. We always love to hear from our readers and we're grateful for each and every subscriber. So thank you so very much. And I guess we will see you next time. All right. Thank you very much. Stay safe. Bye.